katika zile pita pita zangu kwenye mtandao wa X kitambo alikuwa anaita Twitter nimekutana na barua moja ama nyaraka ambayo imeandikwa na jama fulani kwa hiyo inamaanisha kuwa mtangazaji ambaye anajulikana kama Mike Mondo yuko tabani Mike Mondo ni mtangazaji kwenye kituo ama shirika ambalo linajulikana kama Radio Africa Group wakati fulani huwa anasikika pale Classic 105. Sasa huyu Mike Mondo kuna siku zilizopita ambapo jamadi posti picha ama video za yeye na watoto fulani kwenye mtandao wa kijamii na ilibua Isia mseto baadhi ya wale ambao wanatumia mtandao wa X walikuwa na msuta wengine pia wanamsifia. Sasa jama huyu siku ya leo he bana kuna barua ambayo ameandikiwa. Mike Mondo aliingia kwenye mahusiano na mwanadada fulani ambaye pia aliachana na bwanake. Kwa hiyo mwanadada huyu baada ya kuachana bwanake akaamua kuishi na watoto wake. Alafu baadaye akaingia kwenye mahusiano na Mike Mondo. Sasa Mike Mondo akaanza kuposti picha na video za wale watoto wa huyu mwanadada kwenye mtandao wa kijamii. Sasa baba ya watoto akagongana na picha kama hizi kwenye mtandao ndao wa kijamii akakereka kachukua hatua za kisheria sasa hii ni barua ambayo imeandikwa tarehe tisa Januari 2024 sasa imeandikwa advocate James T Macori advocate eh bana our reference JTM stroke 481 stroke 2023 your reference TBA Mike Mondo Radio Africa Group Classic 105 Lions Place Westlands Nairobi akaandikiwa dear sir reference cease and desist uh, we refer to the above matter and write to you on behalf of our client Ramadhani Oluoch our client instructs us that after parting ways with the mother to his children you took the bold steps of picking up from where he left and he commends you for that however He instructs you that with the time you develop an aura of pettiness and overstepped your boundaries as a boyfriend to the mother of his children and even had the audacity the photos of his children online we are further instructed that you have children of your own whom you do not post but you choose to post our client's children for clout and attention and our client wonders to what and it will be so unfortunate if you are using innocent children to drive listenership and improve rating for your show as a radio presenter you are expected at the very least be well acquainted with the media law to understand why mass media outlet typically blur or pixelate the faces of children in the photo and videos to protect their privacy and anonymity We are instructed that on two different occasions during the festive season we went ahead and posted photos of you and the mother of our clan's children together with their two sons on Instagram and the same found its way to the X mobile application and the wrath of Kenyans on X befell you as they called you out for this repugnant and unpalatable behavior that you had to delete the photos screenshot of which we have in our possession all this while not sharing photos of your own children action not only embarrassed our client and made him trend at number one on the x mobile application but this exposed the children to the breach of their privacy and possibly setting them up for future ridicule and bullying at school since the adults around them have failed in being objective with their action it is from the above for going that we hereby are instructed to demand that you pull down all the photos of the minors from all your social media platforms cease and desist from posting such photos ever again and issue unconditional apology to our client within 72 hours failure to which we have mandatory and equivocal instruction to institute a legal proceeding against you in the court of law you are faithfully and kate david advocate kwa hiyo baba ya watoto hawa amemwandikia barua kupitia wakili ambaye anajulikana kama James T Macori Advocate akimwambia bwana Mondo 
hakikisha kuwa picha za watoto wangu umezidiliti ama kuzifuta kwenye mtandao wa kijamii na uweke tu picha za watoto wangu kwa maana unaposti picha za watoto wangu ilhali wewe uko na watoto wako kwa hiyo mzazi huyu amekerwa zaidi baada ya mfanyakazi kwenye stesheni ya Classic 105 ambaye anajulikana kama Mike Mondo kuposti picha za watoto wake kwenye mtandao wa kijamii kwa hiyo kuna wengi ambao wamedondosha comment zao hapa kuna huyu ambaye anajulikana kama Gabrielo Guda ni jamaa ambaye amepata umaarufu zaidi kwenye mtandao wa X anasema 72 hours start running from when with love to be there no matter what Alafu kuna mgeni anaitwa Tommy amesema hiyo leta haina stamp so it's not official. Alafu sasa mwenye aliposti barua anasema ya kuwa this is a draft. The stamped one he refused to receive or acknowledge. I don't joke around my kids. Sasa jamaa alitumiwa barua akakataa kupokea. Bana. Sasa kuna mgeni ambaye anaitwa Kahiga anasema but you had an entire YouTube show where you posted the very children you are now privacy protecting kitchen dinner breakfast bedroom literally all the aspect of your life tough call tough call alafu kuna mwingine ambaye anajulikana kama bumbibi anasema lakini si pia wewe ulikuwa na posti ela na bio dad ako ama ehe sasa kuna mwingine pia anajulikana kama liviti anasema in some instances the rule of the jungle is the best modus operandi Alafu sasa jamaa huyu mwenye aliposti barua akasema jail is full of guilty lovers I'm a free man because I think before I act. Alafu kuna mwingine anaitwa Vinzila underscore Ras Baby anasema you've just reacted venye walitaka. Alafu akaweka emoji mbili za kucheka. Alafu sasa musika mkuu akasema troll me for protecting my children. Mwingine anaitwa Anola anasema using innocent children to drive listenership as in improve rating on your show. Eh bana, sasa ni comments ambazo zinadondoshwa na wale ambao wanafuatilia makala hizi na ishu ya mwanahabari ama mtangazaji kwenye kituo cha Classic 105 Mike Mondo kuandikiwa barua na baba ya watoto ambao aliwaposti kwenye mtandao wa X na vile vile Instagram. Kwa hiyo ni habari ambazo tunazofuatilia kukaribu na bila shaka tukipata mengi tutakosa kuwajuza nyinyi kama wanahabari 254 usisahau kusubscribe kwenye channel zetu za habari 254 na Bonga Boli TV pale YouTube ni angalau uendelee kupata taarifa zaidi. Shukran Jidan, marhaba Habib tunawapenda sana.